Greetings. Sorry, I've been ignoring everybody for so long. Just been caught up in trying to get my clothes taken care of and out of my house because I've got so much. I uh, put up a Facebook page with all pictures of the clothes. There's actually a couple of things I found that didn't get pictures of that I've got more to put up. So God knows when this is going to end. But I think it's about three days since I posted a video, which is a bit, a bit crazy, isn't it? Um, you know, it's not like I've been that busy, but there's not been very much to say. I think the most exciting thing that's happened to me over the last couple of days, other than distantly socializing with a few people that I know <clears throat> that I've not seen uh, since lockdown or before, was uh, as I was uh, reaching in for my hand sanitizer and was about to put it away, I noticed there was this brown goo all over my hands, which I went to smell and there was no smell. I thought, what the hell is this? Did something come out of my pocket? Not had any candy or anything in there. So I, I look down and a bird shat right where you put your hand in your, your pocket for your hoodie. It's bird shit. So I can tell you, bird shit does not smell. Um, however, it was absolutely vile. It was the beginning of one of my long walks. But of course I had my tissues because you never know when you might sneeze or something comes on and you'll need a tissue. Especially in this climate. I had shit ton of hand sanitizer. So I managed to clean myself up pretty good. I thought it was going to bring me all kinds of luck, but it hasn't. In fact, my gambling has been terrible. Um, so bad that I'm worried that I'm, I probably have to stop or something. Because uh, it's not like I'm spending more money than I used to. I'm actually spending less money than I used to. Um, but it's just I'm not winning and I'm not earning. So probably can't afford to do that either. So life is going to be really exciting soon if I can't even gamble. But uh, anyway... That is the excitement of my life right now. Now, I'm not going to mention why I'm at this train station. Because, you know, uh, there's nothing bad anyway. But, um, yes, I'm waiting for a train just now. <clears throat> so, I've heard they're pretty dead. So, I'm a little apprehensive, as you would be, because it's the first time since lockdown I've been on any public transport. But I imagine I will survive. I think things are pretty safe these days over here in Glasgow. But in the meantime, stay away from me, don't touch anything, and wash your hands.